Well, it's the largest number of illegal snakes found at one time on Oahu. Yeah, a woman turned in five young boa constrictors to the Hawaiian Humane Society this afternoon, along with two illegal lizards. The story from KITV 4's Kilki Kerr. This is the plastic container with five juvenile boa constrictors that a woman dropped off at the Humane Society around 1 this afternoon under the shelter's amnesty program. If they got tired of them or just, you know, enough pressure and they didn't want to keep an illegal animal anymore, that's, that's what we're here to do, is to take the, the animals without questions asked. These snakes are friendly and docile. Look at how this one approached our camera and was not scared of humans at all. They're able to be handled, so they were somebody's house pets, and so I'm, I'm not afraid that they were, you know, out there in the wild being born, but they, they were animals that somebody had in their home. Initially, animal handlers do not think the snakes are siblings. And it was probably a collector, someone who wanted to collect different colors and varieties. They're illegal in Hawaii and could wreak havoc on our environment if they started breeding here, which is why the sheer number of them, five, is very troubling. You know, with our delicate ecosystem, we don't want these you know, non-native animals out there probably eating some of our native creatures. The woman also turned in these two illegal lizards. The larger one is believed to be a savanna skink or perhaps a savanna monitor lizard, which is native to Africa and eats snails and beetles. The smaller one is a blue-tongued skink, which comes from Australia and feeds on insects, fruits, and flowers. And the Humane Society turned over those reptiles to the State Agriculture Department late this afternoon. Now the Ag Department will relocate them either to the Honolulu Zoo or to a facility on the mainland. Back to you, Laura.